Ah, you hear those foundation after midnight boys got DJ Skip back? It only took him a year and a half. Oh, okay. Good afternoon, foundation staff. This is level four researcher Theron Sherman. And today's broadcast illustrates that you can hire the brightest academic minds, and they're still going to be morons. This is item number SCP-5149. Level four classified, object class Keter. Special containment procedures. Efforts to trace the source of SCP-5149 are ongoing. Description. SCP-5149 is a radio signal of unknown origin being received by Lunar Site 34 every 24 hours. Attempts to locate the source of SCP-5149 have been inconclusive, though it has been ascertained that the signal is coming from outside the solar system. SCP-5149 consists of a short repeating message in UTF-8. The message is constructed of a series of 44 dots laid out in a complex position pattern interspersed with empty space in certain locations. Due to the extrasolar nature of SCP-5149's origin, this is believed to be an extraterrestrial communication or language system. At the moment, decryption of SCP-5149 is considered a Class A priority. A team of cryptographers, linguists, and radio technicians are stationed at Luna 34 for this purpose. Attempt Log Attempt 1 on January 30th, 2014 Ran it through all modern language translation systems for similarities. A formality. Translation failed. Attempt 2 on February 3rd, 2014. Ran it against dot-based ancient languages. No distinct similarities. Translation failed. Attempt 3 on February 7th, 2014. Ran a new task on the analyses computers. Attempting to discern the complexity of a dot-based language. Translation failed. The table then omits 145 lines. So we're moving on to attempt 149 on May 29, 2014. New analysis computers arrived. Broke them in by trying to simulate all possible divisions of the message. Translation failed. Attempt 150 on June 30, 2014. Manipulated base through flips, rotations, reflections, and several stretches and compressions before putting it through previous suite of analyses. Translation failed. Now the table emits another 96 lines. So we're moving on to attempt 247 on October 1st, 2014. Not a message at all? Maybe art? Compare for logical consistencies or repetitions of symbols to confirm if even language. Translation failed. Attempt 248 on October 13th, 2014. Connect the dots? Worth a try? Translation failed. Attempt 249 on October 20th, 2014. Greenhorn suggested we run it through nonverbal languages screener. <laughs> Poor guy thinks it'll really be that easy. Translation success! Within 0.5 seconds of the scanning, screener produced an English translation of SCP-5149. It was realized that no individual on the project had recognized the transmission as a form of braille. The decrypted message on SCP-5149? Help! I can't fucking see! Investigation in the source of SCP-5149 is ongoing. Decryption team have been reassigned pending demotion. See what I tell you. Just because you got a PhD doesn't mean you want a dumbass. <laughs> All right, staff. That ends our broadcast for the day. Use your Foundation Encrypted YouTube account to like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell. Support our broadcast at patreon.com site 42. See you guys in quarantine.